कॉन्सेप्चुअल अप्रोच टू स्टडी ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री बाय आईज ऑफ ए के सी वट इज द रीजन बिहेंड द फॉर्मेशन ऑफ लास्ट नंबर ऑफ ऑर्गेनिक कंपाउंड टू डिस्कस दिस क्वेश्चन स्टूडेंट्स सीज कैटेनिशियन साइज इलेक्ट्रॉनिक एटिविटी इलेक्ट्रॉन एफिनिटी दे आर मैनी एंसर्स गिवेन बाई स्टूडेंट्स बट ऑल दिस answers can be correlated only on the basis of size and position so the correct answer is the position of carbon in the periodic table when you say position of carbon that means it includes everything that is its size electronic activity position electron affinity bonding tendency catenation everything therefore the correct reason behind the formation of large number organic compound is only position of carbon in the periodic table what atom is the center of attraction in whole organic chemistry that is carbon because carbon is the central atom on which organic chemistry is derived A study of carbon is the reason of organic chemistry there are 90 90% compounds known so far which are organic in nature therefore a separate branch is given to study carbon and it is called as organic chemistry what is the position of carbon in the periodic table when you ask to write the position of carbon in the periodic table then you must write its period as well as group therefore the position of carbon is in second period and 14th group what is the electronic activity value of carbon hydrogen nitrogen oxygen and fluorine in polling scheme these are some general atoms which form organic compounds so the value electronic activity value of these atom must be known by students the electronic activity value of carbon is 2.5 hydrogen is 2.1 nitrogen is 3.0 oxygen is 3.5 and fluorine is 4.0 the value of electronic activity is also important to decide reaction because when carbon is attached to oxygen it means electronic activity of carbon is 2.5 and that of oxygen is 3.5 that means the difference is only of 1 but when hydrogen is attached to oxygen in that case the difference is 3.5 minus 2.1 that is 1.4 and this difference is more as compared to carbon oxygen bond that's why acid base reactions are faster as compared to organic reaction so these data must be known by students what is the valency of carbon hydrogen nitrogen oxygen and fluorine the valency of carbon is 4 hydrogen is 1 nitrogen is 3 oxygen is 2 and fluorine is 1 this valency must be known because carbon only form tetrahedral geometry and that tetrahedral geometry can be explained with the valency of 4 only if compound is not tetrahedral you may compound may be planar may be linear but carbon must be bonded with four atoms may be from pi bond may be from sigma bond what is the symbol for the representation of all halogen the symbol is x x is general symbol given to all halogen whether it is fluorine chlorine bromine iodine write the decreasing order of bond strength of carbon fluorine carbon chlorine carbon bromine and carbon iodine bond when you carefully analyze the bond strength a bond bond strength of carbon halogen bond then overlapping of carbon fluorine bond that is 2p 2p orbital in case of carbon chlorine it is 2p 3p orbital in case of carbon bromine it is 2p 4p orbital but in case of carbon iodine the overlapping is of 2p 5p orbital and we know that if atomic size are nearly same then it must have good strength of overlapping therefore carbon fluorine bond has higher value 
as compared to carbon chlorine, as compared to carbon bromine, as compared to carbon iodine. Which bond is weakest in carbon hydrogen and carbon carbon bond? We know that in case of carbon hydrogen, the overlapping is 2p s orbital, but in case of carbon carbon, the overlapping is of 2p 2p orbital. Therefore, the weakest bond is carbon hydrogen. That's why in case of alkene, the reaction of carbon hydrogen bond takes place and this bond is broken. And mono substitution, di substitution product is obtained, whether it is monochloro, dichloro, or trichloro. In all the cases, carbon hydrogen bond is broken and not for carbon carbon bond. Write the decreasing order of bond strength and bond length of carbon carbon single, double, and triple bond. The bond length of carbon carbon single, double and triple bond follows. Single bond is larger as compared to double bond as compared to triple bond. Must know the value of carbon carbon single bond. It is 1.54 angstrom and carbon carbon double bond it is 1.34 angstrom and carbon carbon triple bond it is 1.20 angstrom. You must remember the bond length of benzene also. In case of benzene all the bond length of carbon carbon is 1.39 angstrom. When we compare the bond strength, the carbon triple bond has larger value because three bonds are involved, greater than carbon carbon double bond and bond strength of carbon carbon single bond is lowest. Name at least 10 ordinary compound which make life easy. Think at least 10 ordinary compounds which make your life easy. A student may write aspirin, nicotine and many compounds but we carefully analyze we find that nearly everything around us is made of carbon that is sugar sugar we use it makes our life sweet medicine to make life disease free clothes which we wear to make our life stylish perfumes and cosmetics to make fragrance in life, the beauty makes it lit. Dynamites and explosive. To break rocks and to build buildings and house. Hormones, vitamins, proteins and carbohydrates. To make life possible on earth. Paper. To write anything which we want to see to someone. Trees and plants. Greenery and natural beauty to enjoy life. Dyes to color the jeans and suits for good luck, petrol and diesels to transport us and our things from one place to another place. That is nearly everything is made up of carbon. Thanks for watching.